Science 5, Quarter 1, Week 3 Identifying objects at home and in the classroom as solid, liquid, or gas Revise K-12 Curriculum with me, Teacher KMT. Good day, kids! Today, we will learn about identifying objects at home and in the classroom as solid, liquid, or gas. Objective Number 1 Recognize common materials seen and used at home or in school as solid, liquid, or gas. Short review to be guided by your actual teacher. Lesson Purpose In our past lessons, we discussed the different characteristics of matter and its different phases. We also familiarize ourselves with their properties. This week, let's get closer to the different materials we use at home, in our classroom, and be able to classify them as solid, liquid, or gas. Unlocking Content Area Vocabulary Number 1. Matter Everything around us is matter. It's what things are made of. Number 2. Solid A solid keeps its shape like a toy or a rock. Number 3. Liquid A liquid flows and takes the shape of its container like water or juice. Number 4, gas. A gas spreads out and you can't see it like the air we breathe. Number 5, texture. This tells us how something feels like soft, rough, bumpy, or smooth. Number 6, weight. How heavy something is like lifting a backpack full of books. Number 7, mass. The amount of stuff inside something, no matter where it is. Number 8, molecules. Tiny building blocks that make up everything. They are too small to see. Number 9, shape. The form of something, round like a ball or square like a box. And number 10, color. What your eyes see, like red, blue, green, or yellow. First lesson, identifying objects at home as solid, liquid, or gas. Explicitation, to be guided by your actual teacher. Work example to be guided by your actual teacher. Lesson activity to be guided by your actual teacher.
objects at home as solid, liquid, and gas. Solid. We have rock, wood, ice, metal like table, paper, plastic, glass, and book. Liquid. We have water, milk, juice, oil, soda, soup, honey, vinegar, coffee, and alcohol. How about peanut butter? Is it a solid or liquid? It's mostly considered a thick liquid or a soft solid, depending on how you look at it. Let's learn more about it. Non-Newtonian fluid It does not always act like a regular liquid. Sometimes it behaves like a liquid and sometimes like a solid. It all depends on how you treat it. Therefore, peanut butter is an example of non-Newtonian fluid. Imagine this. If you poke it fast, it might feel hard like a solid. But if you touch it slowly or gently, it feels soft and gooey like a liquid. Here are the examples. Ketchup. Shake it and it flows easily. Be gentle, it stays stuck. For toothpaste, sits firm in the tube but spreads smoothly on your brush. Going back, gas. We have air, oxygen, carbon dioxide, helium, steam, methane, chlorine gas, and propane. Second lesson, identifying objects in the classroom as solid, liquid, or gas. Explicitation, to be guided by your actual teacher. Work example, to be guided by your actual teacher. Lesson activity. Let's answer. Number one. What are the materials in the school clinic, school canteen, school garden, school library? Great! The materials found in the school clinic are dental chairs, tablets, syrup powder medicine, syringe, alcohol, betadine, cotton, gas buds, ointment, and many more. The materials found in the school canteen are plates, sauce, vegetables, drinks, and many more. The materials found in the school garden are garden tools, soil, plants, pots, water, 
water container, water hose, and many more. The materials found in the school library are books, newspaper, television, computer sets, printer, and many more. Number 2. Can you classify the materials as solid, liquid, and gas? Great! Please read the following. Number 3. What can you say about the materials found in the different areas in the school? Awesome! There are different materials found in school. These materials can be classified as solid, liquid, and gas. Performance task. To be guided by our actual teacher. Learners take aways to be guided by your actual teacher. Reflection on learning What is the importance of knowing the different materials that we see around? Awesome! Knowing different materials helps us understand how things around us work and how to use them properly. It also teaches us to stay safe, make good choices, and take care of our environment. Evaluating learning Given below are materials or things that we can see at home and in the classroom. Identify what specific materials you can see or you can connect in each material or thing and classify them as solid, liquid, and gas. The first one is done for you. Let's take a look at the picture. The first picture is special chapsui. Solid Different vegetables, boiled egg, and salt. Liquid, fish sauce, water, liquid seasonings. Gas, LPG used in cooking. Now let's proceed to number two. Great! Solid. Fish, pebbles, decorative rocks, plants, glass tank, liquid, water, gas, oxygen in the water, for fish to breathe, air above the water. It is important to note that oxygen, which is a gas, is present in an aquarium. Number 3 Very good! Solid, ice cubes, straw, plastic cup. Liquid, soft drink or soda. Gas, carbon dioxide bubbles. Carbon dioxide is also mixed with carbonated drinks. Number 4. Amazing! Solid, rubber material of the balloon. Liquid, none. Gas, 
air or helium inside the balloon. It is important to note that the gas inside the balloons can be carbon dioxide if inflated by a person using his or her breath or helium. Number 5 Correct! Solid, crushed ice, sweet beans, nata de coco, jackfruit, banana, leche flan, purple yam. Liquid, evaporated milk, syrup, melted ice, gas, air around or inside the glass or container. Well done, kids! What have we learned today? Today, we learn about Objects at home as solid, liquid, and gas Solid, we have rock, wood, ice, metal, brick, diamond, paper, plastic, glass, and book For liquid, we have water, milk, juice, oil, soda, soup, honey, vinegar, coffee, and alcohol. Lastly, gas. We have air, oxygen, carbon dioxide, helium, steam, methane, chlorine gas, and propane. Moving on, objects in the classroom as solid, liquid, or gas. It is important to note that the words to be mentioned are just sample answers. Solid, we have eraser, chalk, paper, books, TV, clock. Liquid, water, healthy drinks, alcohol. Gas, air, oxygen, carbon dioxide. Kids, thank you for listening. I hope you have learned. Please do not forget to click the like, share, and subscribe.